An estimated 400,000 Assyrians living in the U.S. today, and a growing number of them live right here in Arizona. It's an ancient culture, an ancient language, and our local Assyrian community is making sure their ancient traditions are kept alive. I sat down with community leaders to learn how they're accomplishing that. If you don't know an Assyrian, you really don't know about their history or their culture. Norta Kasu is part of a growing Assyrian community here in Arizona. The Assyrian roots dating back thousands of years. Biblical times, Mesopotamia, Babylon, that region. So those are the Assyrians. Today, they are scattered around the world. We don't have a physical country on the map that says Assyria. Um, Assyria is here in our hearts. But she's made a birthright trip to Assyrian land, which is now modern day Iraq, Iran, Syria and other surrounding countries. Today, more than 25,000 Assyrians all call Arizona home and they work to keep their customs and traditions alive. The biggest ones is the Assyrian New Year. Recently, Ninorta headed up an effort to get the Assyrian New Year recognized in Arizona. She and others recruited Arizona State Representative Judy Schwiebert to help. Frankly, I've lived in the valley my whole life, but I never knew about the Assyrian American culture. Representative Schwiebert sponsored the resolution and was able to get both state Democrats and Republicans to sign off. This is a nonpartisan thing to really help celebrate our constituents. March 20th, the House passed the resolution and 10 days later, the Senate. It's a moment Ninorta and fellow Assyrians won't forget. It's the feeling that recognition of who the Assyrians are and the celebration of the Assyrian New Year um, it just, it was just amazing. Ninorta hopes this resolution will help other Assyrians living in Arizona feel seen and know this is a state that celebrates who they are. We are extremely resilient. We are a resilient group of people. You know, in the future, she would like the state to recognize the Assyrian genocide as well. That took place from 1914 to 1923, when more than 300,000 Assyrians were killed. A bill was introduced in Arizona back in 2020, but so far it has not moved through.